so hi guys it's precious bria welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you how i did this beautiful braided ponytail um and it ended up being a lot easier than i um than it's been in the past i used this different technique that i got off of tiktok and it just made the entire process so so simple so let's just jump right in um, the first thing I'm going to start off by doing is just detangling my hair. I'm spraying it with some heat protectant. I'm just gonna be blow drying and then you're gonna see me flattering in it because I wanted it to be as like slick as possible. And this process did take me a little bit of a while. I also did, um, I did cut my ends. I didn't record that process um, just because I didn't realize I wasn't recording, but I needed to cut my ends. So I definitely did that.
So I did end up slicking down my hair with the Mary's Beeswax. Um, I'm not sure if I got the right one. Um, I believe that this was supposed to be like an edge control. This did not keep my hair as slick as I wanted it to be. I think definitely still continue with the same process that I used. If I had to go back and redo this, I think that I would do the... Um, the process where you just spray some good holding spray and then just use your um <clears throat> blow dryer and do it that way because using this murray's like it looks really nice and sleek but after a while it just honestly didn't look the same something else that works really good for me when i'm sleeking my hair is you can use the gorilla snot that always does the job or you can use some got to be glue gel um i know that a lot of people don't like to use that but that will also get your hair really really sleek you have to use the yellow one and it's gonna come off white but then the whiteness will go away eventually so that's another option um, as well. And anyway, you see me here just making sure that everything is nice and sleek to my liking. You want to get your, your edges. You want to make sure to get your beady beads in the back. Because <laughs> you want everything to look really, really slick. So here is the technique that I'm using off of TikTok. So basically, you're going to be taking one um i don't know what to call it we can call it a bundle for giggle's sake um one bundle of the braiding hair you're just going to split it in two and then you're going to put the rubber band around it as you can see me doing in the video um and then when you flip it over your hair is completely covered um you want to pull out a section of the hair because this is what you're going to use to wrap around you wrap that around first um and this is just going to help to keep that little tiny ponytail look now usually when i do it it is a lot more bulkier now it doesn't look crazy but it is a lot more bulkier so i did really really like this technique um i wanted to make sure that that little piece stayed typically people just use hairspray i went in with the bobby pin because most of the time, the hairspray, for whatever reason, just does not work for me. Um, now I'm going to start braiding the braided ponytail. Um, be mindful that I wanted mine's extra long, so I did end up adding additional braiding hair. You can do what you want. This hair was already long. I think it started off at like 30 inches or something, but I wanted it to be a little bit longer. So I just took my time and I went in and I braided and I added the extra hair and stuff like that. And yes so after you're done braiding your hair you want to make sure to dip your hair in hot water i did not show this part on camera but you want to make sure to do that and you also want to make sure to tie down your hair just so that everything can stay as sleek as possible i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and definitely try this new technique bye guys don't forget to like comment subscribe and share